Hi, my name is Chloe and these are some of my crazy friends. A few days ago, we visited the Dock Visitor Centre near Mount Aspiring National Park. We were there to get prepared for a very important mission, which was to become Kiwi Rangers. Becoming a Kiwi Ranger is a lot of fun and it's not that hard to get started. But we have a booklet and we have to fill it out and then when we hand it into the dock office we get a badge sure we've done it. There are heaps of cool activities in the Kiwi Ranger booklet. People can do them on their own if they want to but we were lucky enough to get help from Andrew and Jean, two friendly dock rangers. Our first activity was to close our eyes, listen quietly and map all the sounds we could hear around us. Then we learned about some of the animals introduced into the National Park. Some introduced animals get up to all sorts of mischief which sometimes harm native plants and animals. Well, goats eat the bush and then kind of annoying to some people. And what are some of the ways that possums threaten our native birds? They eat the foliage on the trees. Yes. And they eat the eggs yes. of the birds. Then it was off into the forest. The native bush in Mount Aspiring National Park is lush and green and full of colourful surprises. Um, sharp jacket. Yeah, teeth leaves. This is called moss and it's a real short and it feels like funny. As part of our Kiwi Ranger scavenger hunt, we had to keep an eye out for colourful markers. Ranger Andrew was especially interested in the blue ones. These are markers for um, 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 traps, uh, stoke traps down this track. There are lots of native birds in the National Park, but also lots of things that want to eat them. To catch nasty rats, feral cats and stoats, Ranger Andrew has to check his traps often. And he walks through there, and he walks onto this, boom. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> One of the coolest things was walking across this swing bridge. It's a bit wobbly, but it's exciting walking over the river. As soon as we reached the blue pools, we were sent off on our next mission which was to find some rocks. One rock had to be dry and the other wet. Ranger Dean asked us to put the wet rock under our armpits. It was really cold, but after a while the rock heated up. Hot rocks keep warm for a long time, which is why some people build their houses out of them. But we had other things in mind for some of our rocks. How many skims are you going for? Don't know, but I swear I probably won't do good. Okay, yeah, see, I've done really good. Yeah. Six. I got seven. Charlie's done this before, I think. Mm. Wow, what a good shot. So, you guys, we can, uh, when we slow the film down, we can count and we can see if we've got more than 50, and then we can claim the record off whoever it is who's got the world record. Oh. That was one. We also visited the Makarora field base, where we got to interview some of the other rangers. Um, why do you like being a dock ranger? What's the fun of it? Okay, well the fun of it I suppose really is working in the great outdoors. Yeah, you've got a big national park, lots of nice bush, rivers, birds, sound. It's nice to be out there, no matter what the weather is, you know, it's uh, also very challenging. After 
after a quick visit to the historic Makarora Pitsaw, we headed to Lake Hawea to complete our last Kiwi Ranger mission. The water was really cold, but it made us think about just how important water is for drinking, washing ourselves, making plants grow, pretty much everything we do in life. The best water is clean and fresh. It's, uh, it's from, like, um, from the top of the mountain. Which okay, is a glacier that is a glacier, yeah. And it comes down through a river or something and comes to a lake. After a fun day in the National Park, it was time for our graduation. Oh, yeah. Well, I can officially, you are now a Kiwi Ranger. And you know what, in a few years time you can grow up and Dot will be wrapped if somebody like you came along with it. Watch me cute. Good speech. It was a great way to end an awesome day and I would recommend it to anyone because...